so today we are talking about gender. We received some questions from you guys, so we're going to go straight into that, starting with number one. Number one was, what do we think the gender is going to be? I am very adamant that it's going to be a girl. Um, I, everybody seems to think it's going to be a girl, so I'm going to go the little other route. I'm going to go boy. That's what yeah. I'm going to go with. We're go totally boy. content with either one. But I, it really doesn't matter to me, though. Yeah. Like, we just want a healthy baby. Like, that is just the number one. It's priority. just the stories I've heard from people or similar people in similar situations as ourselves. I feel like it's going to be a girl because of that, but... Who knows? Yeah, a lot of people right now uh, on YouTube and as well as family members or anything, uh, friends. Oh, like you're everybody. Going to have a girl. It's a girl. It's a girl. It's everybody like, on YouTube has said girl. So y'all can be I... shocked <laughs> when it pops out a boy. Yeah, I'm going to be shocked. But... So that was that. Um, are we going to find out the gender? So originally, um, we wanted to find out like just us in the doctor's office. But then we were like, well, this might be our only baby, so I think it'd be fun to find out with everybody because yeah. we are going to have a gender reveal party, which was another question that you guys asked was, well, were we going to have a gender reveal party? And we are. So we're going to find out with everyone else. Yep. Um, our party is December 8th. It is before we have our 20-week ultrasound. So lucky for us, our embryo was PGS tested, so we already know, we don't know the gender, yeah. but the gender is written down. So um, when we go into our next appointment, we'll just have her write down what it is. And so that's yep. kind of an, uh, a good thing about IVF is mm -hmm. you could find out basically before the embryo is put inside you. Yeah, if you do the PGS testing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we're excited. We're really looking forward to that. Yeah, for sure. It'll be a good day. Um, uh, some of you said when will we announce the gender, um, like I said, our, our party's December 8th, so maybe a few days after that we will videotape all of it, yep. um, and we will definitely put up a video, so if you are interested in that, then... It'll be posted. Yeah, mm -hmm. a couple months from now. Yep. Um, have we discussed names for the baby? We have not. I think we're trying not to yet. just not... Yeah, not focus on that yet. Yeah. We're just trying to make sure baby's growing, and mm -hmm. I think once we find out the gender, we'll start talking names, but yeah, we got plenty of time. Sure. Yeah. So see, that was quick. That was all yeah. the gender questions. Yep. Um, I also got some cute, cl I'm getting clothes already, baby clothes, which is super exciting. Um, my friend, I feel like every time I see her, she's like, I got new baby clothes for you. Um, so she gave me, my friend Michelle, she gave me this cute little, this could totally be for a boy or girl. And that's a zebra. I totally thought it was a cow. I don't know why, but I did. It has so a little that, zebra on, somewhere around here. Was, <laughs> where? Oh, <laughs> it does have a zebra there. Yeah. I never noticed that, but. Okay, so that was one cute outfit. And then today, she today's my birthday. So she got well, me. Birthday. Oh, thank you. Yeah. She got me, so she thinks it's a girl as well. So she got me two girl onesies. This one has a little ruffled butt. I think that's cute. <laughs> and then she said, and then just in case you do actually have a boy, she did get me a boy, but I would totally put a girl in this, or I would put whatever in this, because it's just pajamas. Super cute. Yeah. And then I got more maternity clothes from my neighbor, Denise. She gave me two bags of clothes, so I am set on clothes, I think. So we're very fortunate. Yeah. We have some very kind people in our lives, yep. so absolutely helping us out. Mm -hmm. Um, what was the other thing we needed to address? Uh, upcoming video. Our upcoming video. Oh, by the way, if you're wondering, I'm 12 weeks tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Um, we can show you a baby bump. It's a little bigger. I think it's a little bigger. Yeah. Well, for new subscribers, we'll probably end up putting the link of kind of like our summary video. Of yes. How we got to this point in our lives. So. so I'll, in the description below, I'll put the link of our pregnancy results or pregnancy tests and that is the whole video sums up pretty much everything yeah. if you've never seen one of our videos that video sums everything up with our mm -hmm. whole IVF journey but our next video that we want to put out is it's gonna be how much IVF costs for us we won't go into specifics we'll just kind of go generally how much it costs we'll kind of break things down a little bit but not like to the nitty-gritty yeah. And then also in that video, we're going to talk about why we chose to PGS test our embryos because I know some people choose not to. It can be a controversial topic. Yeah, that's, that's a very sensitive topic 
for people. But we but, just want to give our viewpoint on that. Right. And then the third thing we wanted to talk about was how did we pay for IVF? A lot of you have been asking how did we pay for IVF. Um, there's something that we did to help pay for it that we really have not talked about. Mm -hmm. Actually, just very few family members even know. So yeah, um, I, I, yeah. we're ready um, to kind of share and give more details on that. So if you are interested, that yeah. should come out in the next week sometime. So yeah, stay tuned. Stay tuned. Yeah. Other than that, that's all we got for today. Yeah, we'll post a little. Oh yeah, we said we were going to post yeah. a little baby bump. So we'll show you my baby bump. Yep. All right. So here we are, 12 weeks. It's a little bigger. Here's the front. A little bump. Here's the other side. Yeah. It looks bigger looking down, but obviously. <laughs> <laughs>